you have never seen Come Die With Me, you do not have a claim to be British. It is possibly the most quintessentially British TV show ever made. Four people take it in turns to cook for each other at each other's houses. They then rate each other's cooking and hosting abilities and the winner gets a grand. It is incredible. What a sad little life, Jane. So today I'm sitting down with three of my friends to watch this show and we're drinking every time the narrator says something irritating, someone makes something disgusting and every time one of the contestants says something tonight. This is, this is going to be a hoot. Subscribe now or I'll come to your house and tell your mama cooking is bad. And she'll be very upset. Right, Jack, you're not drinking because you're a coward. I'm not a, a coward. I've got to beat up a man. It's the most manly thing. You're fighting some geese. The most brave thing. How are you going to do that with a bit of, without a bit of alcohol in your system, Jack? Whenever I'm clobbering a geezer, I've got to be at least three pints down, Jack. Right now, with all the training I've had, if I had alcohol, I'd be the most dangerous thing on the streets. <laughs> That's why I've got alcohol-free Prosecco. Oh, lovely. Okay. I pulled up fancy to the George Mimulus recording today. What is the point in that? Surely that's just horrible. It's good, man. I like it. Why wouldn't you just have a soft drink? No, it's good. It's Good. You don't even get any of the benefits. I like to pretend I'm drinking still because I miss it. All right, we're, we're, we're going to be watching an episode of Come Dine With Me. I love Come Dine With Me. I love Come... On today's show... Cheers. Deadly Discoveries... His name's Diddly. Wait, what? On today's show... His name's show. Diddly. Cheers. Deadly Discoveries... <laughs> No, I don't think that's his name. I think Diddly it being like Little Discoveries or something. I don't think Diddly is his name, Jack. His name, bro, I think his name is Diddly. His name is not Diddly. You say that, but he wear, look at his fit. Look at the fit. That's a man named Diddly. <laughs> that's the diddliest motherfucker I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> This week we're in North Somerset, where some of the oldest dinosaur bones in it. This is some really fucking heavy music for this. <laughs> we're in North Somerset. Fuck yeah! I reckon, you know what, that dinosaur thing is is already, like, I'd say it's irritating. <laughs> what? That dinosaur pissed me off, bro. I'm not joking for that. You really want me to believe that you really thought it was a real dinosaur, you prick? Don't take the piss now, Jack. What? Don't take the piss. Look, I'll drink with you. Look, mm, mm, Yes, mm. you're yummy alcohol for... Uh, okay, I'll give you one, but I will be fighting the other ones. No, I, that was irritating. He wants me to believe that he's really terrified of this piece of plastic. Fuck off. I like to watch films I can get through three or four a week easily. That just sounds like a normal amount of films. Yeah, it's not absurd. I could get through three, even four of a week. What, a film every other day? <laughs> he's a madman. My dessert is going to leave everybody with a happy ending. <laughs> he's going to make them come, is what he's saying. I'd like that. I'd give him a 10. If I came after eating some food, I'd, I'd rate it highly, yeah. Oh, yeah, for sure. I want to shoot some ropes after I eat, you know? <laughs> shoot some if I eat a good meal, I'm blasting rope, man. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Our final guest this evening is Nick Honey. <laughs> Look at the fucking shirt. He definitely <laughs> uses Reddit. Yeah, yeah oh, 100%, bro. He, 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 like, moderates the Discord. <laughs> he has kittens. By night, I... You're Batman. I'm the navigator talking Greek like alphabet. No! no! One of my nicknames at work is either Nictionary or Nickopedia because I am a... I feel like that second nickname is the one you want to be fucking careful of, to be <laughs> That second nickname, <laughs> he had me on edge for a second there. That can be very misconstrued. Yeah, I, I panicked. Miles. Yeah, Miles, yeah. yeah. Would you like a Pims? Pims is... He looks very uncomfortable, Miles. Yeah, he's struggling. He knows females. He knows ladies. But this is a new challenge for him. <laughs> Two of them in the same room. Sometimes I use big words, which yeah. I don't understand, no. to make myself sound more photosynthesis. I love using big words so I can perpendicular. You just... Oh, he just stole his joke. You just took his joke and made it worse. <laughs> that was horrific. You can't was... retell the same joke to the man that told it, but worse. That's so bad. Oh, my God. He's going to use it. He's gonna steal it for a bar. And it's ready to go. Oh, that does look quite nice. And apple it does look right. That, that, is, what the fuck? that is an enormous burger. Look at that. That's fucking huge. That's the meatiest <laughs> burger I've ever seen in my life. How can you wrap your lips around that? That's a ball. No, I can wrap my lips around meat that size. What would you cook if you were on Come Dine With Me? Oh, I don't know. I, I like steak. I make a good steak and I'll just pretend like that's really hard to do. It's really easy to do, but I would pretend because I can't actually cook very well, George. What about you? What would you cook? Um... Tomato pasta with cheese on top. Everyone <laughs> likes that. That's a solid Everyone meal. likes the garnish of cheese. It's a hearty meal. <laughs> Lemon lush with a little ickle heart shaped Mickey. Oh, fucking hell. George, get a drink down you. What the fuck was that? Uh... The fuck did he do? Ickle, ickle, chocolate biscuit. <laughs> I'd like to think I can retire at 50. Retire at 50? Yeah. That's not too far away. <laughs> <laughs> George! George! I don't even mean to say it. I think he just lacks, like, social cues. Even if you think someone's close to 50, you wouldn't say it. No, you but I do, I do stuff like that too. I just say without thinking. Like, me and him, <laughs> me and Miles are like, we're kindred souls. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You're the worst kind of person. 
No, I think I'm pretty great. Maybe she's wound up by the fact that she thinks that I'm implying that she looks 50 when obviously she's not. Bingo! <laughs> He's not a human. He's like <laughs> chat GPT put into a person. <laughs> Might be wise. She's got a gaff. Yeah, well, that's, that's a nice fucking gaff. What does she need a grand for? Look at that kitchen island. That kitchen island is as big as my house. I pronounce my starter arancini, very Italian. And also slightly wrong, it's arancini. <laughs> Right, yeah, <laughs> the fucking false Italian accent, Jesus. I'm really pleased with my balls. <laughs> I have been there, <laughs> I have said that. I was trying to think of a joke, but I was just like, I couldn't, there were too many. Testicles, the joke is testicles, George. She's talking about man's balls. Nice flowers. Well, I never. Is that a fucking garden? This is off, this is wrong. Who is this millionaire? Wow, look at that bar. That is an incredible bathroom. I don't like that bath. It's really empty. Why is it just like a weird little tub in the corner? Yeah. <laughs> you come for there, <laughs> That's not a fucking bathroom. That is just a room with a bath in the corner and a lot of fucking space. The juxtaposition of where the bath is, is that in relation to where the sun sets or rises? That's not how you use the word juxtaposition. <laughs> Bro just meant position and add juxta on the front to sound smart. <laughs> You can take out the word juxta and just put position and it still means the same thing. No, it doesn't. <laughs> no, it literally it, that it literally doesn't. Nothing, like not even close as well. So it's a frivolous prefix to the word then. You don't really need the juxta part. Right. Yeah, oh. I'm just being a bit ostentatious actually. Fucking hell. I think I've got a vo better vocabulary than Nick. That's me. Every time I go to a, a social function, I eye up everyone's sort of vocabulary and I try and rank myself. Yeah, I'm like the vocab sigma, you know? <laughs> I just really got to dominate the rest of the males in the room with my words. Believer in star signs. Absolutely. Me when I'm trying to <laughs> chat up a woman. <laughs> So yes, I'm a, I'm a Aquarius moon rising. Um, I have a little bit of Scorpio in there. What are you, Jack? You, you must know. Oh yeah, no, I'm a, a Leo, which means I'm full of myself. Cool. I don't think it counts. Like in my case, yeah, but like I'm just really good. I don't yeah. think all Leos are full of themselves. No, I mean, I, I'm, a, I'm a Cancer and I don't know what that means. I think it means I'm quite cute or something. I don't think Cancer's cute, George. I think it's really fucking disrespectful, man. No, no, no. Apparently it means like you're very sensitive. Walter White had Cancer, man. Was he sensitive? I don't, I don't... I don't... Was he sensitive? I think he killed many people and dealt meth to the most underprivileged in society. I think you're a dickhead because of your star sign. Right. Now we're not friends. So, Heidi wow. into the lead. She's gonna win it, I reckon. I reckon she might win. Hate crab, don't like fish at all. Why are you on Come Dine With Me? Surely that's just a very broad food group you don't like. They're British people, all they want is fucking beef, baggers and mash. And some fucking Yorkshire puddings. So moves on to his movie main, a pocket of meatballs now. <laughs> Why are you laughing? It's it's not that's a that's such not a, a good shit. Part of I love the smell of onions in the morning. George? Yeah. It's a dessert. Cinnamon cigar faces. That's a better pun. What is a pun? Scarface. Cinnamon cigar face. Cigar face. I don't know. It works, that's man. It's fucking terrible. I like it. I think it's all right. I didn't get it initially, so it's terrible. <laughs> I don't understand the joke. I don't like it. <laughs> Thought I'd go with a bit of the Bond. Oh, I can see it. I don't recall James Bond wearing a red bow tie. Maybe that's something I missed. Maybe he's got a new job as a waiter. I'm not sure. Snide. Snide. You haven't put adequate research into my movie themed night. Exactly. Snide. Drink. Oh, fuck it. All right. Oi. Oi. We worrying about. Oi. You drinking. All right. <laughs> I'm just trying to be encouraging. I can't drink with you, man. Right. And myself. Who are you thinking? What springs to mind? It's going to be like some pretentious 1940s Belarusian film, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> isn't it? Like. <laughs> no, yeah. It's going to be like the most obscure reference. It's Leon. Leon the assassin. I would never have guessed. Yeah. That. He's an assassin. No women, no children. No women, no children. He's an assassin. <laughs> What? Those are my rules as well. No women, no children, George. Different shellfish at different times in my life. Yeah. Every time there's been a reaction. So here we have the adult meatballs. That's myself and Sue. That was relatively sly, because he was like, oh, you're a child if you can't eat prawns. Oh, do you think? Even if you're allergic, you're a child. No, reasonable. The meatballs got prawns in it. He tried to kill him. Nick had a prawn in his meatball, which that could have killed him. <laughs> it's very exciting. She says it with like such empathy, you know? <laughs> What's the most adventurous thing you've done? Anal. <laughs> yeah, what does he expect him to say? <laughs> I've been pegged. I was rapping. So you know it's coming next, don't you? Oh, please don't rap for them. Good, better, best. Never let it rest. 
till your good is better and your better is best. Uh. <laughs> I'll drink to that. Yeah, take a sip. You deserve that one though, to be fair. I, I, I kind of, I, I, I would have done the same. Yeah, that was deserved, very much deserved. Fucking horrific. Because everything comes back to triangles. So do you like triangle cheese? No, it's about, it's about <laughs> theories. <laughs> How does she have that house? What does she work as? What is her job? <laughs> Who gave her a job? You know, there's other things out there to be fanatical about. Triangles isn't one of them. He's so miserable, isn't he? He is. Drink for it. That's not one of my criteria, but okay. They were snide, bro. He's disrespecting her triangle beliefs. Say hello to my little friend. <laughs> Holy guacamole, what just happened? <laughs> she fucking laughed at the simplest joke on earth. Like, like as if she fucking just sat through like the best comedian stand-up routine ever. It's just the way he went, holy guacamole. No. Holy guacamole. He's out of a cartoon. He's not real. You can't tell me he wouldn't have a Minecraft channel if he wasn't like 10 years younger. <laughs> He's a Discord mod, man. We said it. I wasn't on point enough. I served uh, Nick the prawns, which was a massive faux pas. Stop saying faux pas. I still don't think that's right, you fucking moron. That's not what a faux pas mean. A faux pas is like a social taboo. <laughs> Almost killing someone with food is not a faux pas. <laughs> it's frowned upon. No, it is frowned upon, to be fair. The main nearly killed me. So for that reason, a seven. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> he, ne he nearly killed me, but I'm still going to give him a higher rating than the first person. She made burgers and it's just pub grub. <laughs> Six. He nearly fucking murdered me. Seven. The dessert wasn't to my palate, but so for that, I'm going to give him a nine. Hey! This is rigged. How are you a point behind? My menu is French inspired. Um, I like his shirt. It doesn't make any fucking sense. <laughs> Why are there books? Hey man, you all look at your phones. He reads books. It's inspired mm. by my granny Hanny. He can't help but rhyme. He tr he's a true lyricist. He's like Eminem if he used Reddit. That's what... <laughs> Dessert splodged onto mango chunks. Nick pops them into chill, leaving him just ah! a hip-hop twist on the proceedings. Ah! So, ready to serve. Me every day when I get out of bed. Ready to serve, Jack. <laughs> you really are slay, George. I can't eat mushrooms because they have a yum yum taste to them. What? What the fuck is she saying? Yum yummy taste. It's like eating a slug or a snail is something that's slimy in that, but then you get a yum yummy and that's nice. How has she bought a house? <laughs> I don't believe they haven't paid this woman to act like an idiot. I can't believe it. I think she's just broken into that house while the owners of it are on holiday and passed it off as her own. In fourth place, Sue. <laughs> she took it well. Imagine that just being basically like your food is shit. You're a shit <laughs> host and your food is the shittest out of everyone in this room. Her food looked all right. Everyone was just like, it's kind of basic, but like it looked all right, man. If I got fourth in Come Down Me, I would think I would be genuinely offended. Yeah, you should, but I, I, and Sue didn't deserve it, man. Nah, Sue deserved better. I'm fucking shooting for Sue, man. She deserved better. Heidi takes the thousand pounds. She needs it the least. What, what you, you don't care. You don't care. Stop celebrating. The rich just get richer, Jack. Eh? It's the way the fucking world is, George. Totally and utterly gobsmacked. I can't believe it. A thousand pounds. Wow. This is a life changing sum for me. <laughs> I'm going to go spend it at a restaurant tonight. <laughs> Any closing words, Jack? <laughs> The weirdest fucking group of people I've ever witnessed. <laughs> they were so unique. Is that your closing words? That's my closing thoughts, George. All right. I don't know what the fuck they were on about. On to the next episode. James, you love a bit of Come Dine With Me, don't you? I've not watched this show in years. And you're not drinking because, again, you're a coward, as per. Yep. Yeah. As per, been a coward for over a year now, George. It's pathetic, really. Yeah, someone should bring a halt to that. <laughs> how about today? How about we just? How about today? Yeah, I, f I reckon we break it today at two p.m. Yeah, let's uh, let's send it. Let's let's have let's let's have a, a raucous one in on a on a Saturday afternoon. <laughs> it was just awful. Oh, avocado! It, it it genuinely could be the worst food. You think? No, I quite like it. I like it on some things. On its own, it's vile. I don't understand how people can eat it on like toast and stuff. Yeah, right. But like guacamole? No, dude. You don't like guacamole? No. The only time you can have avocado is when it's in Mackey, in my opinion. In oh Mackey, okay, right. Yeah, yeah. Not Mackey's, not like McDonald's. Yeah, like for McDonald's a second I thought I, I thought you were going to a very different McDonald's to me.
The intro always gives me Cluedo vibes. You know? <laughs> like a murder mystery. Manchester, home to the record for the longest two-man hug, which lasted an awkward 27 hours. How long do you last, George? I'm in a hug. I'm in. Uh, in a hug? In a, in a magic hug? Uh... Magic hug? What are you, five? <laughs> <laughs> in a magic hug, you know, I think my all-time record is maybe like 50 seconds. Wow. What, longest or shortest? Longest. Mm. Yeah. Of course it's longest. Who the fuck is... Yeah, no. Right. I mean, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a two-pump Andy, you know. It's a, it's a sprint, not a marathon. <laughs> yeah, right. If the sun was made out of bananas, it would be just as hot. That is bananas! I would consider that irritating enough to drink. That is bananas! Right, okay, all right. Uh, cheers. You don't seem too up for drinking at this time. It's quarter past two in the afternoon and I have stuff to do. <laughs> Nacho pie. I think it might be. <laughs> and Michel Rougignol. He looks like a 2012 gaming YouTuber. And baby photographer yeah. Thomas Demol. Baby Sorry, what is he, what's his job? Yeah, he's definitely a 2012 YouTuber. <laughs> <laughs> What? Oh. <laughs> oh my god, that's disgusting. That's a drink. Yeah, that is a hard drink. That fucking hell. Make baked beans in a pie. I'll kill myself. To be fair, they are they are authentically Mexican. Not to dessert. Mexican tiramisu. <laughs> With dessert. Oh Chris Christ! Melted it's a Mexican tiramisu because he's made it tequila man. Because <laughs> it's so bad, it will kill someone. All right, I'm drinking to that. That was terrible, James. Yeah, thanks, man. Prep done. Chris has time to do an impression of a rocket. That was irritating. You can drink for that. Yeah, but that Chris has time to do the thing of a rocket. All right. Hi, Chris. I'm Wendy. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You'll love it. What? You'll love it. What are you on about? You'll love it, Wendy's nuts fit in your mouth. Because <laughs> her name's Wendy. Oh, okay, Wendy's. Wendy's nuts fit. That's clever, James. Oh, Christ. He is a 2012 yeah. YouTuber. He's got the Insomnia oh, well, Gaming like Festival in. fit on. That, that gives pub like, quiz. Yeah. <laughs> I think Regan is a little bit thick. Was that Snide? Yeah, that is Snide. She called her thick, George. Just an, an amazing thing. Brace yourself. That is absolutely fucking vile. Yeah, that's genuinely disgusting. If someone made that for me, I'd put a hit on their head. <laughs> It's nice, it's lovely. Nice and spicy, actually. Very nice. You know your food's shit when people say, oh, this is very nice with absolutely no enthusiasm whatsoever. I invent cocktails, though. Do you? Yeah, just Hell yeah! Sorry, right, I don't drink anymore. I need to calm myself down. <laughs> You're getting a bit excited, James. I miss pina coladas, George. One won't hurt, James. I'll turn a blind eye. <laughs> You're so... I, I love it because you know for a fact Twitter is going to go wild <laughs> if you leave that in. One doesn't count. Yeah, right, okay. You're allowed to drive after one drink. Twitter, every time I do anything about sobriety, you leave a comment, you just get quite <laughs> But it's funny. <laughs> okay, yeah, no, you're all right. That does look half decent. I would scran it, though. Hard scran. I don't think he went through a lot of trouble to make this. I'm not impressed by the main cast. I think this slow cooked chili went down an absolute storm. <laughs> <laughs> He's an idiot. So where are you from, Chris? Like Milton Keynes. Oh, that explains oh. it. That explains it. Like Even though they're really small, have a little bit of gravity that pulls them together. I think Regan didn't know what they what they were talking about at all. She's coping, man. She has no idea. She's going like, oh yeah, Regan had no fucking. Did you see the look on Regan's face? Snide, you got a drink. Right. Wow. wow, look at the. Do we have to wear the hat? That's, That's a fucking massive tiramisu, to be fair. Course. Yeah, good luck trying to wear that hat, dude. You'd put the fucking thing in your head. I'm a uh, data business analyst for an international telecommunications company. That sounds so fucking boring. Sounds like you on a dating app. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't too keen on the tiramisu. I didn't like it at all. I think I was great. I think the food was great. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great. To be God. blissfully ignorant, man. I love it. I'm going to award him a seven. Chris oh, is a, Wendy. Is a, is a, now I'm going to give Chris a six. I'm going to give Chris a seven. To be fair, that is a fucking unreal score considering he made nacho pie. Well done, Chris. Well, I've been salty uh, if I came below. Sorry, sorry, <laughs> sorry. I've been sorry. salty if I came below Chris. Sorry, I, don't. Sorry, I didn't mean it. I... I we can start that. We can start that bit again. It's gonna be all about the phone. It's gonna be all about the good chat, and I'm definitely aiming for tens tonight. Me when I go to the club. <laughs> Multiple. <laughs> you know me. I'm aiming for tens tonight. God, you're such a hot business analyst. <laughs>
God, can we just let the nachos rest? And beans. See, these kind of beans I wouldn't mind. The fact that the other guy put baked fucking beans yeah. on my <laughs> is mental. On to dessert, tequila cheesecake. Why would you do that? It's done nothing wrong. You should break your sobriety for that. Yeah. That should be your punishment. Thanks, man. When is this, senorita? Me, when I head to Spain. <laughs> Thank you. That's Riz right there. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that looks abhorrent. Yeah, that Jesus. looks fucking horrible. It looks like a, a smiley face, but one of the eyes is just diseased. I itself was very dry. I'm sorry I gave you a dry pie. Oh, God. I, I hate the way British people do innuendo. <laughs> I'll give you a proper wet pie <laughs> next time. <laughs> you fucking go to jail. <laughs> do not pass go. <laughs> You're right, Wendy. <laughs> like that. She sounds absolutely mental. <laughs> <laughs> That's snide as fuck. All right. It's here, looking like it's just oh, out that of a fucks. packet. Yeah, that looks pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. I'd scram the fucking shit out of that. <laughs> <laughs> the thought of when. Oh, poor Wendy, watching this back with her family, <laughs> has been absolutely rinsed for her laugh over and over again. She has one last chance to out Mexican Chris. Oh. It looks a bit wet. <laughs> Buy me a drink first, you know. <sighs> My cheesecake's all soppy. Seven, seven, six. How on earth did she get the same score as the guy who made nacho pie? I'm so sorry, Regan. You've been done dirty. This is just orgasm on a plate. <laughs> English extravagance. Best surprise. It's like the French guy walks up to the house, <laughs> just not letting. <laughs> Try and pronounce that, James. Go on. Pâté de foie du volet. COVID. See, that's what I don't get. When people literally see letters, it was C-A-L-V-A-D-O-S. You can only pronounce that in a few ways. One of them isn't whatever the fuck she just said. <laughs> Cavaladeidos. It cannot be made out of those fucking letters, dude. <laughs> You're really angry about this. No, it pisses me off when people try to pronounce them. And there's just those letters aren't there. They're not there. Calavaladeidos is not there. Vale are Cadavos. Cadavos. Oh, cheers. He bathes the vegetables in another fancy machine oh, for just my over God. an hour. That's it. Just put it in an oven, lad. <laughs> you know what I mean? Dessert. Paris breast. Which I wouldn't mind. <laughs> <it>. <laughs> wouldn't mind a bit of Paris breast right after my meal. Wouldn't mind a bit of a Parisian breast. A <laughs> nibble. Bit of a suckle. I'll have a little squeeze of a Parisian breast. For the filling, Thomas blends homemade praline, then combines it with cream, sugar, and homemade custard. Okay, I would this eat the shit out of this. Yeah. He's just trying too hard. I would love it if he got the lowest score out of everyone. Yeah, he probably will. I think that would be unreal. Oh, that does look fucking unreal. Is that... A knitting basket. Oh. Does he knit doll clothes? Um, I would be fucking terrified. Yeah. If I walked into someone's house and they knit dolls clothes. Yeah. In their thirties. French liver pate with homemade bread and a fanned cornichon. Woohoo! This is beauty on the plate. Oh, it looks green. Like there's a green hue on the plate. Never ate liver before. Because it sounds like, um, so it's something that can come out of a human. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, mate, I wish that. Nah, I wish more people were like that. I, you know, let's let's bring back simplicity. <laughs> On to the main. Thomas carefully pan fries his duck to the perfect oh. pink. Nice. Very nice. Oh, George, I'll be There's honest. I'd eat the shit out yeah, of that. Yeah, I would eat that. Oh, George, I would eat, I'd eat the ever living Christ out of that dish. Mm. Right now, I could just. Yeah. In like three bites. That's, yeah, that's solid. I'd scram that so hard. So, what do you think the British. Do better than the French. Everything. Everything. Not surrendering in wars. <laughs> okay, dude. You're just a bit real. But. The ways of love. You know, you turn the light down and then you just think of England. Okay, he has hit the nail on the head there. That's what I do anytime. <laughs> even even masturbation. I just I simply turn the lights off and think of this wonderful country. Blast rule Britannia. <laughs> yeah. You could argue that we ganged up on Thomas a bit, but I think that's just the um, circle of life. Certainly we beat them at Agincourt, we beat them at Waterloo, we beat them at <laughs> <laughs> Thomas good there, I think That's it. hilarious. <laughs> this, is, this is such a product of its time, you know what I mean? <laughs>
<laughs> Imagine anyone saying this now. We'd applaud them still. <laughs> That's really good knitting. Is there nothing this short Frenchman can't do? <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Oh, he just has to fit in a little. He is short though. <laughs> he is short. Whilst getting um, a magazine from the very top shelf may be a struggle for him. <laughs> He's had a good run. <laughs> this is me complimenting you. <laughs> <laughs> you got a drink, by the oh, way. That is no, All right. Paris Brest, uh, which, as you can see, doesn't involve any boobs. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that moment died a death. Jesus Christ! Oh, he really let that one sit. Oh, it went really, really well. Um, well done, man. Was a hit. Well done. But Hopefully, you get laid. Uh, sometimes soon. Great food, great hose, and I give him a nap. Great hose? I think she said great hose. Not <laughs> we didn't see those. A nine. A ten. Whoa. Whoa. Thomas flies into the Well, we know who's Yeah, we know who's done this now. Realistically, you think Wendy from Manchester <laughs> is bringing out a better course. I think Thomas thinks he's got the cat in the bag. He has, Wendy. <laughs> he's he's lost two points out of 30. The British are going to win. As per usual. Oh, and it's, it's an instant L. Goat's cheese. No, goat's cheese. With goat's cheese is sublime. It's incredible. Next, the main. Okay. Okay, we're talking. If you get Dauphinois correctly. I don't know what a Dauphinois is, James. I didn't go to private um, school. What is Dauphinois? It's a type of potato. It's, they, they do go hard. I think Adopia potatoes originally. What are you saying? <laughs> I can't understand them. <laughs> James's impression of the average Mancunians. So what have we got here? Houses. So what do you think she does? One lady. Yeah. I'm gobsmacked. I didn't imagine her doing oh anything. God. She's a landlord. No, she's a property developer. Big difference, James. Oh, okay. Fucking Tory ass. I'm not even going to say anything, James. I'm not even going to rebuttal that. The audience can do that for themselves. I think we've got the French guy on the run. Because As per usual! There's this brilliant British ignorance. All the three Brits like, oh, we've got this in the bag. Nope, the French guy could literally just give her a seven and it'd be over. That's it. I've got over 100 houses. My idol, my queen. Over 100? Oh my God. At this rate, George, it, there's a high chance we're living in one of them. <laughs> If she had a hundred like twenty years ago, why does she need the grand from this show? She's got a hundred <laughs> houses. A hundred houses. That's at least oh, no, like it's, fucking. It's tough for landlords, George. There's an energy crisis. That's at least like twenty, thirty million. At least she's made she's... the rest of it. Hold on, this is the girl boss. Yeah. Wendy's the girl boss. Yeah. All of this, all that's been happening throughout this episode, she's the girl boss. She's gonna win. We find the British accent in France a little bit exotic. Oh. So if you can speak French with a very British accent, then you got a good chance. Jim really? Regan. Wow, Jim Appel Jimbo. <laughs> <laughs> he, uh, and um, hold on, hold on, yeah, George, on. give me pause right, it yeah. one sec, yeah, pause yeah. it. Uh, Hola, um, je m'appelle George. Je m'appelle Jimbo. Je te verrai bientôt, France. What does that mean? I'll see you soon, France. <laughs> It's better to do it how the British do it. What you want to do is say, all right, love, I've got you a shot. Do you fancy a pizza back at mine? God, we are eloquent, aren't we, George? Yeah. Vanilla panna cotta. That looks a bit sad. This is going to knock yeah. him out. I would eat the shit out of it, though. That I would eat good. it, but it does look a bit sad. I don't think it competes with the French man's booby or whatever it was. Mm. So light and so good, it really finishes the week well. She might have a chance, you know. No, I don't think so. No, because... Should I put money on it now? Go on, do you want to put, put money... Regan's going to give her a 10. So I'll tell you what, I'll give Wendy... No, she's lost it. Oh, no, she's lost it. A ten. Oh. He's French. He's he's not giving her a ten. The French don't believe in oh. perfection. Thomas. Um, it's nice to see them actually happy about it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Thomas oh God. He just touched his arms. <laughs> Did you see that? No, I, no, I would never. I never. I would never do that to my friends. <laughs> I'm gonna hear that in my fucking nightmares. By the way. Well, Alex, we're watching an episode of Come Dine with me. Oh, yeah, I love Come Dine. Actually, the best one. What do you mean it's the best? Best one of what? Uh, well, I, the videos we've done, I thought it was hilarious the last one we did. Oh, I've, I've, uh, Alex, I've only just noticed this when going through the edit. What is that on your neck? That, that's disgusting. Disgusting. Uh, do you remember the rules from last time in terms of the old... Uh, 
Clink, clink. Uh, drink every time you want to strangle one of the contestants to death. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. We just drink every time somebody makes me cringe. Yeah, I, yeah, sure. Woohoo! All right, drink. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You complain. What, the... what if we... If we tune into the next Misfits <laughs> boxing event, what's going, what's going on here? Oh, no. Well, yeah, none of the food has ever looked that good. No, never. A lady of leisure with a special little friend. Bentley goes everywhere with me. What the f- what? What the f- what? Painting a dog's- what? Hot and cold messy. I think it definitely is not English. Doesn't sound like you are either, fella. <laughs> 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 oh my god! <laughs> what the fuck is that allowed? This is probably from about 2007. Doesn't sound like you are even fella. <laughs> That's outrageous. Yeah, I guess that counts. Salvo. Is that the door? Hello there, anybody here? You want me yeah, here? there's a camera outside, <laughs> mate. Yeah, I've been turned up to the wrong bloody door, have they? It's just the house for come dine with me. I don't know, there's only a, a DP. A director, an audio engineer, and, a, and two <laughs> cameramen outside. Would you like some champagne? I don't drink. You don't drink? I don't drink alcohol. Ah, oh, boring. Am I right? Let's drink out of spite. Cheers. Yeah, cheers, mate. You look like a Lady Gaga. Oh. Do you know, is that a good thing or a bad thing? Yeah. <laughs> is that a good thing or a bad thing? Yeah. Guess it depends what Lady Gaga you get, really, doesn't it? It's a sausage dog. It's a miniature sausage dog. No, it's a sausage dog, mate. Fucking hell. Are you okay? I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I've got the champagne. Are you scared of dogs? I'm a bit scared of them. Scared of that? Are you kidding me? <laughs> if you're scared of that, you're fucking perfect. Yeah, get a grip, man. A bit of attention, seeker. Snide. Oh. Snide. Here we go. I mean, you must be mean to. It's a, you're a bit abrupt, aren't you? <laughs> no, really? no, 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 no. Basically, I'm Italian. It's different. I'm Italian. It's different. <laughs> no, you're an arsehole, mate. So I model different outfits like Goldilocks or a giant mermaid. To me, you look like an escort. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> oh Jesus. <laughs> That's definitely a bit snide. But he's Italian. He's Italian, so it's okay. So what are we doing in Italy? Let me finish. Escorts means... Fuck it, oh, he's loud, isn't he? Just she looks like one. No, yeah, no. <laughs> he's just digging himself a hole. He's, yeah, he's messed up. This is painful. Uh. Get your hands Kiss off me. her, mate. Get your uh, hands what off the her. Fuck? What the fuck? Is, what am I watching? Why she lick my face there? She wants you, bro. What, George, what the fuck is this? Come dine with me, Alex. No, it's, this is not come dine with me. It's like a weird, even stranger version of come dine with me. You know what? Talk with the hands. That's well, Snide. Cheers. That's the most Italian thing ever, by the way. Talk with the hands. <laughs> he's, he's so Italian, he just can't help himself. He wants to talk with the hands. He, he just can't stop. Poor bastard. Everything I do is wrong. You can't even call people prozzies anymore, Alex. What happened to society? Back when Gordon Brown was Prime <laughs> Minister, everything was okay. Too much oil on it, and for these, I'm gonna give it a six. The portions were too big. She can cook, and I enjoyed it. And and thank you very much for feeding me. <laughs> and thank you very much for feeding me. He's just like a dog that's been like turned into a human. Thank you very much for feeding me. Starter is Swedish sandwich cake. <laughs> that's just three different words that they put in front of the generator. That's not a meal. What the fuck is a Swedish sandwich cake? Meatballs, fish. <laughs> in a Victoria sponge. Someone's wanking off her thumb. The first layer is mayonnaise, prawns, and pepper. Um. <laughs> Um, do we drink yet? I I think we wait until it's done. Salmon paste and smoked salmon. Do, um, um, George. Uh, you can't, uh, George. You can't see me, but my jaw is on the fucking floor at the moment. With mayonnaise and pepper. No, really. Then she smothers the whole lot in fromage fray, though goodness knows why. That's fine. Well, I'm taking a drink. Cheers. <laughs> Bloody hell, I'm having a pint. Finally, she decorates with gherkins, cucumber, and caviar. What? She's just made that up. There's no way that's an actual, like, meal. Avocado, chocolate, and brandy pudding. Avocado, chocolate, and brandy pudding. She was put in the psych ward after this, wasn't she? What is going on? I would be fucking surprised. Where did she... Where did, where did the producers find this person? I'm sorry, but whoever the producer is who pulled up put her on the show is irresponsible. <laughs> She's, like, this is not right. After a change of outfit, there's time for a drink. Oh, Who is that? Who is that? Is that Slenderman? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? <laughs> <laughs> just, 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 just every now. Is that Slenderman? Is that? 
<laughs> Mate, if I came around your house <laughs> and slid to my house, there's a, there a seven foot butler <laughs> in your house. Honestly, mate, I don't think we'd be friends anymore. I would come. I would never. I would never come see you. I'd be scared of you. I'd be scared of what's going that, on. Imagine that. That's just so funny. Just like an abnormally large it's just butler. A seven foot bloke. He has to be. He has to like bow to you to give you your food. It's intimidating. Yeah, exactly. I would. I'd be part of my meal. You look quite tall, actually. <laughs> Great observation. Okay. Well, okay. I think I shit myself if I walked in there. <laughs> I'd actually scream. I go, fuck! Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, mind your face! Mate. He has to duck. She should have presented it in a nicer way. You can't save that. Yeah, it's no saving those that combination of ingredients. No, mate, like, that's, a, that's like something that like Gordon Ramsay would give to somebody who he generally wanted to see kill themselves. She simply adds her pre-prepared hot mix of mince and salami. What? And <laughs> oh, my God. He's a hair. Oh, my God. Put me right off my dinner. I was really getting yeah. in. Yeah, yeah, I was really getting into that. Oh, God, it's such a shame. I was really getting yeah, into oh. this. And that hair ruined it all. God, oh, that looks really good. Brandy. Oh, you know what? Actually, I'm doing wrong. Oh no. Quick. It's like Dr. Jekyll and Mr. <laughs> Hyde, but they're both awful. And you don't want to let any of them out. I think you should pour a lot of alcohol. And I felt it. Me when my dad let me take a sip of his beer when I was seven. <laughs> I'll give her a five. She gave her a five. I'd be giving her a one. No matter how nice she was, that would not excuse the fucking prawn cake or whatever it was. Yeah, the Swedish sandwich cake. Number one, what is that? But number two, there's no way she's getting above a one because that slender man looking fellow would put me off my meal straight away. <laughs> you know, I'm Sicilian. Usually, when the people come Wait, George. Where do you think he's from? George, is he? <sighs> no. No, he's not. It's not. I don't think so. I mean, he would have mentioned it if he was Italian. <laughs> I don't believe it, mate. Salvo is still really annoying, and I dislike him even more, to be honest. <laughs> I would never hang around with somebody like that in normal life. No, you're too busy hanging around with fucking Slenderman <laughs> and Freddy Fazbear. <laughs> Freddy Fazbear? I don't know who else lives in your house. You know the little thing from SCP Containment <laughs> Breach? Yes. Her house is the containment breach. Just her house is filled with like creepy pastors. It's like Foster's <laughs> home for imaginary friends. That's her house. Jeff the Killer's upstairs in the spare <laughs> bedroom. Meanwhile, she boils apples for her black pudding puree. I've had black pudding puree before. It wasn't very fantastic. Great choice for your dinner party then. Why, why do people do this to themselves? I don't know. Have they been told that they can't just serve up nuggets and chips? Yeah, I feel as though they have probably been given that where you can't just like put nuggets and otherwise the show would be like, if everyone did that, the show would be about 20 minutes long. <laughs> What is worse, all right, the food we've seen on here mm. or the jam tart in the e boys bake off? I'd say the food we've seen on here. Like the last, the the, the last woman, her stuff was worse than the jam tart. I think. I think the the jam tart, although boiled, yeah, savable to an extent. I think, but I would not eat anything on here. Oh no, absolutely not. Look at you. It's a very interesting fit. Looks like something I'd wear. So that's no no points for you, Salvo, mate. <laughs> I'm good. Your mother's you know, I'm Sicilian. Usually, when the people are bad, a mother mom is very dangerous. That's snide. You can't I'm say. Just that you don't joke with mom, especially with Sicilian. Especially with Sicilian, George. Yeah, everywhere else, we just fucking hate our moms. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, but it's just, in Sicily, everything is. That's the one thing you can't do. <laughs> do they fucking hate the Your Mama channel then in Sicily? <laughs> Yeah, it's banned. It's banned. You can't access it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> is he having a break? Is he having a break? You know the joke. You know the joke. <laughs> when he's not, when he's on stage, he's having like the breakdown. All right, Salvo. Okay. What, what do you feel about feminist women, like feminists now? Oh, oh, this is a good oh, no! conversation start. No! Just off the bat, no! what do you think he's about to say? <laughs> Look at his stance. Woman and men, they're the same. Right. Mm -hmm. And women oh, make babies and men can make babies, so we are a little bit different. A, a man can have a baby from his kneecap. Mama, but you I've are heard. completely I've different. Heard. Heard. <laughs> How can a man have a baby from a kneecap? Because you have fluid in your knee. So I can have a baby. You can grow it in there. That was, that's why some are sorry, George. <laughs> Don't know about you, mate. I don't know what I'm going to be doing after this. See you guys in nine months when the family <laughs> channel comes out, everyone. I'm just going to be walking around like this. <laughs> baby in each kneecap, just... <laughs> I like his slippers. <laughs> Look at those fucking slippers. <laughs> Nothing could have prepared me for that <laughs> shot.
<laughs> to grilled aubergine, Salvo adds slices of pancetta, mozzarella, parmesan and lemon juice before rolling. You know what? As much as he is a bit of a prick, like, good food. He's Italian, George. That's yeah. kind of what they do. On with the main course, and no prizes for guessing what the Italians got in store. <laughs> There's no way, George, you just pulled pasta out of the cup. <laughs> He's Italian, what do you mean? If you just stare, because it's Sicilian fish. It's a Sicilian fish, Alex. And he got it out of the pond. What? <sighs> Mamma mia, bellissimo. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. If you had to guess where this man was from, where would you get? I want to say Italy, but I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. Where would you, if you had to, like, like hazard a guess as to where this man is from? Where, where would you say he's from? Because I really don't know at this point. <laughs> this is Sasha Baron Cohen. It's <laughs> Sasha Baron Cohen. That's who this is. If you don't like, it's chocolate bean. That's it. It was just a suggestion. Maybe some sauce to go with it. it might have. I told you, can I do a sauce for you? while I'm sticking on a plate. Before it got to the table. I really want to swear. You complain. That's it. That's what I, mean. I really take my name from. Snide or like threatening? That's not snide. That's just, that's just a bit threatening. Yeah. I'm going to do a bit of a more than a drink. What made you choose this easy menu? Oh. That was snide. That's snide. In bitch with me today. <laughs> I swear. Huh? Yeah, that's another one. Been pinch me all day. Easy menu, easy start. To be fair, she was poking him. She knew what she was gonna she get. She was, back. yeah. You make me not want to eat this now because you're being rude Doesn't to matter. me. If you don't want to eat it, chuck it in the bin. I'm gonna leave it there. You can chuck it in the bin. <laughs> you're, 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 you're the, you're the, you're the I'll chuck gentleman that's serving the food. Oh Salvo, my god. Salvo. I'll chuck it in the bin. It's fine. I'm Oh no, that looked really good. After calming down, Salvo's decided an apology's in order, sort of. Yeah, it was rude. People made mistake in life. People <laughs> killing people, then they go to prison. And then they... I mean, I don't think that's... <laughs> <laughs> what have you done? Yeah, people killing people, John. and uh, you know, everyone make mistakes. Oh, no. That does look solid. Z! Z scored four, that's handing valid. herself victory. Yeah. I'm never going to find a husband if I can't. What about Slender Man? <laughs> I'm ecstatic at the moment. I'm I'm wet. I will. What? Sorry. Um. Whoa. Um. Whoa. 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 Mister, come down with me, voice. Like and subscribe. Oh, yes. Nice. <laughs> what? Good ending. Yeah.